Welcome back, everybody, to Let's Play Dragon Quest IX. We're here on top of the cliffs at the top of the Twill Cave thing. Uh, my main character actually leveled to 16 along the way, even though I've gotten a whole, like, two fights. But it does not grant any warrior abilities nor any skill points, so we do not have to worry about anything like that right now. Wait, 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 wait. If this is a private beach, why are there four people up here, not two? And the other two people just disappear. Okay. Oh, you don't want to just have a little chat, you scumbag. Bull crap. Yeah, yeah, that's what I thought. You jerk off. That's right, you tell him who's boss. Oh, shut up. Wow. You're an asshole. Uh-oh. Holy crap! Yeah! Um, please eat him. Please eat him. Please! <laughs> Look at him scurrying away. Not her! What the crap, man? What the crap? Holy hell! <laughs> I see what you did there, Stella. Shut up. Alright, what happened? Oh, there he is. I was gonna say, what happened to the other person? How did you two people get up here? If this is supposed to be a secret between Jonah and the mayor, what the hell are these other two random people doing here? Yo, yeah, those are the two people. They were here first. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You know, first I'm gonna take care of this issue, and then I'm kicking your ass. But what I find kind of interesting here is Leviathan is, is portrayed as a whale rather than the usual, um, serpent in lore. Anyway, uh, we're gonna use Miracle Slash for once because I'm obviously need a little bit of HP. We're gonna shove multi fists for John, which is pretty cool, and we are going to accelerate. Oh yeah, Kung Fu Master. Now usually that will hit uh, any enemy. Well, if there's more than one enemy, it will randomly select a target each time, so it may hit the same one four times, or it may hit four different targets. Uh. Pretty good on attacking, the only problem with it is, is obviously I don't get the attack bonus with it anymore. See, now I'm gonna heal the damage from that, which is pretty sweet. I'm probably gonna keep using that throughout the fight, because I'm not gonna be able to stack my damage, so... I'm trying a little different technique here this time. Uh, interesting though, is Leviathan only attacks once per turn, where most bosses usually attack twice per turn. Uh, which... It's kind of cool, but at the same time, you saw he does a pretty good amount of damage. And not only that, he's got significantly more HP than the last boss had. Uh, about 500 HP worth. Yeah. Who the hell even was the last boss, anyway? Oh, it was, um... Abijack. That's who it was. And I'm going to heal John, just to be sure. Don't want anyone dying stupidly. Like, with a raging contagion. My god, that was embarrassing. Oh, why did I attack with John? I'm an idiot. And I just spit all over my screen. Funny how it makes like the metal slushy sound. Oh, yeah, that's right. That uses MP, you dork. See, Multifist doesn't. Alright. Actually, I'm gonna try to sap him. Don't know how far that's gonna get me because he has a bit of a resistance to it. 
see, that's what usually happens. Uh, Master and Nun there was kind of lucky with that. Ah, crap. Yeah, that really hurts. Uh, no, not abilities. Spells. And I am going to mid-heal John. Dang it! Do something! Please don't kill Josh. Thank you. Uh oh, sweetness. Ah, great. Um, what to do, what to do, then what to do. Actually, that kind of gives me a little bit of free... Well, not necessarily. Um, what's cool about being in Rage is, yeah, if he attacks only me, that's fine, but it doesn't prevent them from using multi-targeting attacks. Oh, come on! That's bullcrap right there. Alright, good. That'll give me back some HP. See, the only problem is now, well, not only am I out of MP, I don't have the Minstrel anymore. So, I cannot have a second party member healing. I'm gonna heal myself because I'm, he's still enraged at me, so. Oh, for love of crap! Should have done it once by now, at least. There we go. Alright. And his rage still has not subsided yet, so... Alright, you know, screw you, I'm gonna bang you. Not like that. Um, that's actually the one spell he does have a... Oh crap, that did piss for damage. Uh... Semi-weakness, too. Yeah, the, the resistance and weakness things isn't, like... It's, like, percentage-based. Which is kind of awkward, so... Nothing does, like... You know, things very rarely do, like, double damage and stuff like that, so... Um... I am gonna still try to zap you. Um... I don't even know what kind of monster he's considered. So they have, like, a type, and they have, like, a family, too. Yeah, they did crap for damage. I didn't think so, but it was worth a shot. Thank you! God, it only took five tries. There we go. Now, it's, I'm surprised he didn't use any multi-targeting attacks there. And you are dead, sir! Well, we think so. I don't know how you can manage being... Well, whales breathe oxygen, so maybe, I guess so. I was gonna say, I don't know how I could try being up in the air on land so long, but he's a whale. Emerald moss, that is another alchemy ingredient. These bosses are giving crap for drops, but they're 100% drops, so it's not like I can control it or manipulate it or anything like that. And we're just like staring at like, what? And she is completely safe. Okay. Um, I'm actually very grateful for that, but... Yeah. Dude, you were just swallowed by a whale! Holy crap! And you... Jonah, you have a huge heart. Okay, I'll have to tell you that. Hey, look, she's brave, too. I like this girl. What? The... Crap. Did he just talk to me? Okay. All right. Um, this is interesting. What do you think is going on? Wait, you didn't even do anything wrong. I mean, y you died accidentally, and then you've been helping bring fish to the village. I mean, granted, it turned into a bunch of lazy assholes, but 
that wasn't your intent. Oh, great. The fruit. Yeah. And Jonah's like staring at him like, what? <laughs> yeah. You tell him he's being a jerk. But you're kind of, um, dead enough. By the, by the way, well, maybe because of the fig, but he's dead, so why can't anyone but me and Stella see him? But I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go on and live here, and I know people are saying, you know, crap like this, and I sometimes take things too literally. It's not that I'm taking it too literally, it's just the game don't like to explain themselves properly. So in this case, we'll just say it's the fig, okay? But in any other circumstances, this wouldn't make any sense. Dude, you're like eight years old! I mean, I mean, I, I, I'm, I'm very proud of you, Jonah, and all, but... Like, seriously, you're like eight. Or something. Oh, the other little boy came up here. Hi! Oh, isn't he a sweet kid, too? Someone's got a little crush on somebody. I love how nobody else is saying anything. She's like eight! What a sweet dad. You know, y you could have punched the mare in the face once, you know, for good measure, beforehand, please. Oh, what a sweet guy. But can I please still punch the mare in the face? Please? And he poops out another fig! Awesome! What happened to the real Leviathan? Because remember that chick who said, you know, that thing that we thought was Leviathan wasn't really Leviathan? Well, we found out why it wasn't really Leviathan, because obviously it was possessed by her dad or some crap like that, or maybe he became Leviathan, but he disappears, and then you never see the wheel again. Ever! But apparently we know there's a real Leviathan because of what that lady said, so what happened to it? What's going on here? And by the way, no, it's not important right now, and don't take anything what I just said in the last two minutes extremely literally. I'm just making a point here. Nothing more, nothing less. Looks like it has a black screen and a title scroll there. That's all I get. Well, at least they have the courtesy to heal me. Oh, wait, 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 I get to sleep in this bastard's house? No, 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 no. I need to talk to somebody about this. Like, seriously? The only reason to put me in the same room with this jerk-off is to punch him in the face. Dude, you're like eight. How many times have I said that in this episode? A fairy, hmm. Well, can I teabag him then? Please! Let me do something! You know, can I fart on him or something? You know, throw some burnt candle wax in his face? Just something! Kick his ass! Hi there, buddy! Yeah, see, tell everyone that they were being lazy jerk-offs. And they shouldn't have been head bending on the wife in the first place. Mm, yeah, right. Meow. 
I'm sorry, I have to talk to all the kitties. Alright, so now that the ferry is up and running... Hi there! Alright, we'll say goodbye to Jonah before we leave, if it will make you happy. Hi! You're a sweet girl. Can I give you a hug? Yeah, you'll have Bryson look after you. Now, let me on the ship. Hi, buddy. See? See? Now, take me somewhere, Captain. Yes. Okay, that scared the crap out of me when the music just suddenly stopped and there was silence for a second. I'm like, did my game just crash or something? <laughs> and by the way, you cannot control this boat. This is a one-way trip. And wow, that is quite a distance we are going there. You can't build a bridge or something or anything. Stella, you can fly, so what the hell are you complaining about? Yeah, she's still searching for Fat Guts or whoever the hell he is. Better not be some, like, just fat drunk guy who's her lover or something. Although that would be an interesting plot twist. Slurry Quay! That just sounds... Awkward. Yes, there is a ship in Bloomingdale, but we're not going to get that for a while. Well, maybe if you guys have been paying attention, you wouldn't have this problem. Ooh, lump of limbs. Well, hi there. Dude, it's like right across the way. It's like you can see the other side of the river. Holy crap. Money is awesome. And we have a quaint little inn here. Sorry, big on. Of which there's nothing of interest. We're not going to stay in the inn because we've already rested. And we have a save point in here. Okay. Yeah, the, the, this little town isn't really a town at all. It's just like a camp, I guess. <laughs> Nothing really insanely special about it. I mean, they shoved the church in the inn for crying out loud when the priestess doesn't even look like the regular priestesses. Actually, is this the only female priest that saves your game? It might be. I mean, I could be wrong about that, no. And we have two more red chests here. Seed of Strength and another locked chest. No, I'm trying to walk away from it, not advance the dialogue. And we just have just regular old stuff here. Uh, fur hoods. Should we get one? Uh, let's see what else we got. Ooh, pointy hat! Um, uh, now I'll get the fur hood for, uh, John. Pointy hat is, uh, too much of a jump in price without uh, enough of the good stats I want. Whoa, that is quite an increase in defense for John. Uh, I may get that. It's the only problem about the stats is it shows how much it increases it based on what you already have, but it doesn't tell you how much you lose by de-equipping the item that was there, because you know, if I have a deafness accessory, it doesn't show me I'm going to lose that by equipping one of these. Which kind of sucks. Hmm. I'm going to 
hold off on the tortoise shell for the time being. I might just stock up in the next shop. Hmm. I think I already have a pair of those. Fishnet stockings. <laughs> uh, we could get those to John, but, uh, sorry, Josh, but let's not do that because we won't be able to see him underneath this pretty dress. Bow tie. And let's not get anything else. Why did I name my characters all after guys with names of J? I swear to you, I did not think of that until right after I did that. Considering I spent weeks planning on who to put in this game. Because they're my buddies, yo. Alright. Yeah, get with me! <laughs> John looks so funny now. Yeah, there's just like one more thing I want to show off before um, we end the episode. Because I feel like I haven't done anything, even though we, we took on a boss and witnessed this insanely long cutscene. Uh, these guys, I think, can summon backup. And whoa, that was kind of easy. Fairly decent money, though. Anyway, we can come right up here to the shore right here, and there's several spawn points of jugs of fresh water, which is yet another alchemy ingredient. Uh, this place spawns up to several, so. No, 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 no! Basically, I just want to get to the next town, which is, um, like, literally right here. Like, this is the shortest distance between, like, two towns, like, ever. Yeah. <sighs> Yay! This is Dower Bridge. Or at least I think that's how it's pronounced. Um, you know, Slurry Quay is also a, uh, zoom point. So yeah, we've had access to two different new ones. But, anyway, there's actually stuff to do in this town, which is pretty sweet. Um, yeah, there's no actual plot point in here, but there's still a few quick things we can do. But we're going to have to handle that next time on Let's Play Dragon Quest IX. Thanks for watching, everybody, and see you next time. Again. Okay.